what was the most physical intense physical pain you've ever experienced sure let's do that okay so chat i am a guy okay and you guys might know me as nerdy and geeky but i'm a very physical person okay i've done professional hockey like semi-professional hockey i've done semi-professional fighting okay i i've done i've done, worked in the arctic at like negative 60 degrees i've worked in like heavy labor positions i've done like um i've worked with lava okay i've wor worked with magma there's been a lot of times in my life that i've had the opportunity to really hurt myself okay and i've never broken a bone i am very lucky throughout my entire course of uh, my career i've never never even broken a finger bone okay but 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 there was this one time there was this one time that i was helping my dad fix some plumbing okay and in order to fix the plumbing we're dealing with metal so you have to take hot, a hot water like boiling water and pour it on the metal to expand the metal so then you cinch it together and weld it together and the metal will like cool down and shrink over time and like um seal itself okay so my job because i was like i think i was like 13 14 at the time my job was to get the hot water and bring it to him get the hot water and bring it to him get the hot water and bring it to him in a kettle okay and there was this one time that i grabbed it and my dad was like hey 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 jake hurry up hurry up hurry up oh uh, we gotta get this piece in real quick right so i ran with the kettle of boiling water okay and i was running outside and it the grass was wet and slippery and i slipped and when i slipped i threw my hand back with the kettle and the entire kettle unloaded on my calf okay an entire kettle of scalding hot water poured on my calf okay like instantaneously like a uh, um first degree burning on this entire thing and getting into second degree burn right um from there um i instantly ran with the adrenaline i didn't feel any pain i ran to the bathtub and just started pouring cold water in the tub and like was calling out to my mom and my dad and stuff like that if you guys don't know my dad's blind so he has no idea what happened right he's completely blind so he has no idea what just happened i run i i start pouring the cold water on my legs stuff like that and my mom comes in with these like um, medical towels that she wraps my leg around with and like pours cold water. And the entire time that uh, I, with the cold water, no matter what, it was just burning. Like just imagine that feeling when you put your hand on like something hot and it hurts temporarily, but like it just has this pulsing like pain. My entire calf, the entire calf, like my entire lower leg was scalded. Okay. We wrap it up. And unfortunately, where we lived was in between two hospitals and the two hospitals were both an hour and a half away so for the next hour and a half i'm sitting with a completely burnt leg pouring in constantly cold water onto my calf c-a-l-f calf pouring cold water onto it until i could get to a hospital we get to the hospital and here is where i'm a little shit. okay we get to the hospital and the nurse asks me okay sir um you what what's going on and how much pain are you in and on a scale of one to ten so i tell her it's like okay um i, I burned my calf with a pot of the like boiling water and it's like a six out of ten like it, it's pretty painful it's a six out of ten my mom looks at me in the face and she's like motherfucker your leg is literally boiling in front of you that's not a six out of ten that's a nine out of ten or a ten out of ten like jick is this the worst pain you've ever experienced i'm like yeah yeah it's like the worst pain i've ever experienced it's like a six out of ten and she's like no it's not a six out of ten it is a nine or a ten out of ten if it's the worst experience you've ever had and i'm like okay um nurse i think it's like nine out of ten at this point she's like can i take a look at it and i'm like yeah here take a look and like it's boiling over like the skin is like boiled up and like it's all red and white and like it's getting that like that water layer underneath it because it's a burn and she's like that's an 11 out of 10 you're coming in right now you're coming in immediately so they they wheel me in to um what you call it the er because as soon as you get there they don't want you to like walk anymore they get me to lie down on a table and they put flamazine all over this wound 
The second they put the Flamazine on the wound, what the Flamazine does is it cuts off the oxygen to the burn. The pain instantly went away. Dude, Flamazine chat is amazing. The pain instantly went away and the wound, uh, Flamazine helps the wound uh, heal. They wrapped it up and they're just like, yep, yeah, you're good to go. I'm like, this is literally magic. Like I have never experienced such a magical healing process. Flamazine is amazing. So they hit it with it, wrapped it up, and I was good to go. <laughs> my mom is brutally honest. If there's if there's something you need to know about my mom, my mom will tell shit like it is. Okay, she is on um, which belt? She's a boomer. She has strong opinions, but you know what? She loves me, and that's what matters. She loves me so much, and like I love my mom. But yeah, Flamazine is absolute magic. <laughs>